When I look at this product, the first thing that comes to my mind is this product represents a cumulative effort of so many people on the site. And you think about everything that went in to make the small granules. This is a very innovative way to provide a solution to the growers. It allows them to replenish their sulfur deficient soils with just one product, and that is MAP MST. We are at the Suwannee River Chemical Complex located in White Springs, Florida. And in this complex, we make MAP and Smart Nutrition MAP MST. Smart Nutrition MAP MST is MAP with the addition of MST, which is a micronized sulfur technology. And essentially, we micronized the sulfur and incorporate it into our existing monoammonium phosphate process. The cool thing about MAP MST is that sulfur particles are an average of 15 microns. And that's important because the smaller the particle size, the easier it is to oxidize it from sulfur to sulfate, which is the form that plants need. So the smaller it is, the better it is because it allows for that slow release of the sulfur that they need across the growing season. MAP MST is homogenous, meaning that it is uniform. There is no difference in anywhere you cut it because a consistent product yields a consistent result. MAP MST is made by combining three different raw material inputs. The key ingredients in MAP MST are ammonia, phosphoric acid, and sulfur. When we combine ammonia and phosphoric acid, there's a reaction that takes place and that creates the MAP slurry. At the same time, we're taking sulfur and mixing it in our homogenizer. The MST solution and the MAP slurry are mixed in our pug mill and are granulated. And that makes Smart Nutrition MAP MST. The quality of uh, the MAP MST is controlled in several ways. We have specific parameters that we've tested, and as long as we operate within those parameters, we can be confident that we deliver the micron size that customers expect. And we also take quality samples from our product stream and send that to the lab. And specifically for MAP MST, we analyze the sulfur composition of the granule, we make sure that the products that we make meet the specifications that we have told our customers we will meet. We take great care in making the product safe to handle and use. There's guidance from the Sulfur Institute that sulfur products that contain about 25% sulfur or more may have a propensity for flare-ups. In our case, MAP MST, we limit it at 15%. In addition, we coat the final product with an oil to keep it from dusting. Even though this is a new product, people can feel confident that it handles very similarly to a regular map, and it's not only safe for us to produce, but it's also safe to store and handle. It does make me proud. We can produce something like this that is wanted and needed all the planning, all the hours spent, every sacrifice that everyone in this facility made is essentially to address the need for the grower, which is to replenish sulfur deficient soils. And by creating this new product, MAP MST, we address that need. Such a small particle can have such a big impact in our ability to grow food.